So I'm sure you've heard about Democrats in the Senate unveiling their latest gun control push. And of course, the president has already hinted at executive action if he cannot get Congress to go along with him. See, the president could use his phone and his pen to require that even the simple transfer of a firearm between family members, like if my husband handed down his rifle to our oldest son, be treated in accordance with FFL requirements. So right now, the ATF doesn't issue FFLs for total personal use only. But if this were to change, then the ATF would be required to treat your home and your family as they do all gun dealers. This means regular inspections. You would be publicly listed with the other licensees, and you must allow the ATF to inspect your record keeping. Ta-da! National Registry. It's the same thing, by the way, that Hillary Clinton has proposed as an executive action should she ever become president. Now, they're mum on all of the details, but they give just enough and are predictable enough to guess their objective. Why are they so quiet on the details? Why do they never outline the specific ramifications of the common sense proposals they dream about? Well, I mean, how do you actually get the name of every mentally deranged person into the system? Meaning, you stop talking about it and you actually do it. Well, you have to rewrite HIPAA laws. So every doctor, every primary care provider, every psychiatrist, everyone who has ever had a patient tell them that they're having trouble with their feelings or they're moody or they sometimes get angry or they have nightmares, they're stressed out at work. Every discussion regarding mental health must be cataloged and reported to the national database. Now imagine that every time someone shouts or gets angry at the office, their boss must report them to a medical professional who then must submit them to the database. Imagine every soldier dealing with nightmares or other symptoms of PTSD reported to the database if they even mention it to their doctor. Imagine neighbors reporting neighbors to the system. Here's my challenge to every politician dreaming of a utopian fantasy world. Go ahead. Write the first paragraph of the law that will make your gun control dreams come true. Read it out loud on the floor of the Congress. Tell the American people about the nightmare you dream of forcing down their throats.